So here it is, here we have it uh, with uh, an inside look. In the bottom part of the amplifier we have the tube the Golf Kilo 71, um, the anode choke which is built according recommendations of uh, Lima Zulu to Zulu Kilo on his site. Uh, it's true that this choke was built for um, um, an amplifier with uh, Golf uh, Uniform 50 uh, tubes, but it's uh, it's working just perfect uh, with uh, this combination with the Golf Kilo 71. A decoupling uh, capacitor, which is uh, uh, at uh, 6.3 uh, uh, kilovolts, because there we have on it uh, 3 kilovolts. Uh, the fuse and uh, the high voltage transformer, which is in fact uh, a microwave oven transformer here, um, which is um, uh, which is plow power supply is uh, ensured by um, halogen bulb uh, of 500 watts uh, shorted during the transmission time. In fact, uh, in the moment where the PTT is pushed, um, the capacitors are charged by this um, uh, by this um, halogen bulb, and one second after the PTT uh, is pushed, um, this uh, this relay we are having here is uh, is making a short uh, circuit um, on uh, on this uh, bulb and uh, the, the the high voltage transformer is on full load. Uh, well, on the top part of the amplifier we have um, uh, eight uh, capacitor of uh, one hundred. Uh, uh, of 1000, uh, sorry, 1000 microfarads at 450 volts. Um, the 12 volts rectifier, um, the output relay, and on the other side we're having uh, the plate uh, um, variable capacitor, which is a Russian vacuum one. I tried uh, to use uh, um, uh, classical uh, air <laughs> Um, variable capacitor, but uh, they were lightning uh, just like a Christmas tree, so uh, no way to use it. Yes, maybe if I would uh, be able to find um, a higher spaced uh, capacitor, it it could be done, but uh, I prefer this vacuum um, uh, Russian capacitor. Um, separation between high voltage and uh, um, P filter is done uh, with this uh, Russian door knob capacitor uh, rated at uh, 15 kilovolts, but uh, it can be used lower also. Uh, anything uh, uh, higher than 6 kilovolts uh, can be used. Um, the parasitic suppressor we have in there, it's, um, it's built uh, using uh, uh, copper pay pipes um, from uh, a brake uh, system uh, of a uh, car, uh, in fact it's a Dacia uh, brake uh, system copper pipe. Um, the, the coil of the P-filter we're having here, uh, the first uh, five turns are done using the same copper pipe uh, from Dacia brake system and uh, the other uh, turns are made in solid uh, copper wire about uh, six uh, millimeter squares, uh, so it's not the diameter, it's uh, the surface uh, six millimeter square. Uh, there you can see uh, the um, P filter band switch, I think uh, we can see it. Yeah. Um, it has to be a ceramic one, you cannot use textolith or pertinax or anything else because it's, uh, it burns in flames. Uh, if it's not uh, if it's not ceramic one, I recommend the Russians uh, um, 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 rotary switches also. <sighs> Rectifying the high voltage is not an easy task. Here we're having uh, five um, five um, uh, diodes by uh, by every arm of the bridge. Uh, they are uh, rated at uh, one kilovolt and three amperes uh, each. Um, <clears throat> so you have to use all the five. I tried with three and uh, they burn out. 
okay in the other side of the amplifier we're having uh, the load uh, variable capacitor which is uh, a classical one not very spaced uh, not very close either uh, here we're having around uh, one millimeter uh, between uh, between uh, uh, plates um, this is the, um, the 80 meters band P uh, filter coil and on the lower part we're having um, the input P uh, filters uh, uh, mounted directly on the switch um, uh, reducing uh, in this way uh, parasitic capacities and uh, stuff. Um, I didn't use a socket in fact for the tube I built my own socket uh, using uh, some copper copper pipes uh, and the screws um, um, this kind of connectors are uh, are very easily to find in uh, electrical um, magazines you know uh, the filament choke is built on a ferret road uh, about 10 centimeters, uh, 12 centimeters long uh, using um, 1.2 millimeters um, diameter copper uh, uh, wire. Um, all uh, the, the, the two, the two uh, um, coils are built um, in fact uh, in the same time. And here we have uh, the filament uh, transformer. He delivers about uh, 20 volts and uh, uh, 4, 5 amperes. On the, uh, uh, on the end part of the amplifier we're having a fan. Uh, the tube uh, it's uh, not heating uh, uh, very strong but anyway a fan is recommended so that's the contract construction of my perestroika amplifier and uh, as you can see a real soviet one uh, hi and now we're gonna uh, make some uh, uh, some uh, power test with it